and welcome back to my channel. My name is Terra Nova and today I am bringing you part number 16 of my Sims 4 Bachelorette Challenge. Part 16 already, you guys. We are getting down to the wire. I cannot believe it. I also cannot believe just how incredibly gorgeous Felicia is. I mean, come on. Who wouldn't love her? But anyways, anyways, today she is having a delicious breakfast of a grilled fruit with uh, Darian. Mr. Darian, who managed to sneak on up in her heart and, and the last part caused quite a bit of trauma and drama. Trauma and drama. <laughs> Jaden got really angry and upset when he saw something happen between Darian and Felicia and... Poor, poor baby Dominic got really, really sad. He's still pretty sad. Um, he's also got a lot of flirty things going on. So I'm thinking if he can get himself to this toilet over here, can you get in this room? Can you go here? Why is this not working? Why can, okay, now he's, okay, now he's listening. But I'm thinking if we can get him to kind of take care of his needs a little bit and then maybe cry it out. After he's not so uncomfortable, he'll be in a good enough mood to come downstairs and chat with Felicia. But it looks like Darian has her all to himself. And Jaden has resigned himself to having a good breakfast chat with Julio, who's got his black fern for breakfast. I have never seen Julio eat. I've only ever seen him have alcohol. And maybe that's a rule that he can't eat. I don't know. I don't know how the butlers work, but I know our butler is a thirsty, thirsty man. All right, Dominic is very sad. Now come over here and cry it out, honey. Go over there, shower quick, cry it out. Felicia needs to go pee in the bathroom you're about to go in. That's right, take your blue slippers back upstairs. So she is going to go to the bathroom and she might as well take a nice bubble bath and she wants to compliment someone so that's something we can do. She also wants to win a game of chess. I think that is something we can try to do. She didn't actually use this so uh, use and massage. Okay. Darian, how are you doing? You and Jaden getting along well over here I see chatting Ludwig with Julio. Wixen. Darian doesn't really have any particular wants. Oh, it's Caden, you guys. All right. So he wants to buy an instrument. He wants to kiss Felicia. He wants to do push-ups. We'll come outside and do some push-ups. Um, it is an elimination round today, you guys. So unfortunately, someone will be leaving later today. But that exercise, do push-ups. That won't be until 3 p.m. And it's barely not even 10 a.m. yet, so we still have some time for the boys to make an impression. Jaden wants to kiss someone, and he wants to play foosball. And now Felicia is nice and playful. You can get out of the bathtub. Your hygiene is fine. Uh, she wants to tell a joke. Um, how are you doing, Dominic? Still very, very sad. Okay, he's just going to go and cry it out now. He just finished his shower. Hopefully that puts it down enough where he can come downstairs and have a decent enough time. Felicia seems to be in a really good mood, so that's a good start. Let's see if we can find Darian and actually, where's Jaden? Jaden is still talking to Julio. Let's see if we can get everyone to gather together. So why don't you come over here and funny tell a joke about fashion. Dominic is in a flirty mood. He's coming downstairs to have breakfast. Darian, please don't go upstairs. I would actually prefer it if you came and sat down here. Maybe join this group conversation. So it's not as much one-on-one -on -one convo, but at least the boys will all get a chance to kind of interact and make a final impression. More choices, funny, tell a joke about fashion. Jaden, what do you want to do besides? Okay, so he wants to kiss someone and he wants to play foosball. We can possibly do some foosball later on. Why are you so tense? You need to show love and have love shown to them. All right, so calm your britches. He wants to go clean something. He's doing some stretching. He's really energized right now. Uh, she's going to chat with Jaden. Dominic, are you eating? Are you, are you gonna move? Oh, Dominic! Dominic! Come and sit. Jaden, not Jaden, Darian. Don't play Go Wake the Llama. Please come over here and sit down. We're having a group conversation. Let's see if we can pull Darian into this. Uh, why don't you brighten his day? And possibly try an engaging story just to get him to, I don't know, maybe engage a little bit. 
Yeah, see, no, he's totally fine when we're talking directly to him. Darian, let Jaden, let's drag Darian into this conversation. Give him a pep talk. Jaden, Dar Darian, okay, I can't keep them straight anymore. Come sit down, please. Pretty please. And Jaden, suck him into this conversation. Give him a pep talk. Felicia, how are you doing? She's super playful now. Shoot, okay. She wants to compliment someone. So let's compliment uh, Friendly. Can we compliment his outfit? And just to make it fair, because I know how some people get nitpicky, we'll compliment all of their outfits so it doesn't influence their relationships any particular way. Um, so she's in the group chat, but she's not really doing what I asked her to do. Alright, so she's not going to win a game of chess because we aren't going to play one. We're not going to be mischievous. We are not going to donate to a charity. Uh, she wants to get to know Dominic. Alright, so let's friendly. And, oop, I passed it. Get to know him. She wants to get to know Julio. Sorry, Julio, this is all about our boys this time. She wants to be... No, we're not going to be friendly with Julio. She wants to woohoo at Dominic. That's not happening. She wants to do butler stuff. She wants to give an apartment key. She wants to get to know... She really just wants to get to know Julio. She wants to level up her charisma skill. And you're not going to critique work. Why don't you discuss interests with Jaden? Um, what, what's something innocent that actually is significant? Ask... No, don't ask him about his day. Um, deep conversation with Darian. And uh, reveal a deep secret with Dominic. She's not even listening. I asked you to come over here and do something. What did I ask you to even do with Jaden? Um, so we could just deep conversation. Yeah. Yeah. I think that's a fine idea. Uh, Dominic, where did you go, sweetheart? Please don't. Please don't. Please don't. Please don't. He really wants to cloud gaze with her. That's so sweet. He also wants to challenge a sim to foosball. Jaden wants to play foosball and he also wants to kiss someone. Darian, Dominic, Dominic, Dominic. Okay. Don't be jealous. Why are you being jealous now? What happened? Now she's sharing a secret. What happened? That made him even more jealous now. This is just bad. Can we try to... Can we smooth apology? Is that a thing? Romance. Uh, da, 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 da. Yeah, no, okay, let's just try to be friendly. Let's brighten his day. I feel so bad. Uh, um... Um, discuss world peace. All she was supposed to be doing was discussing interests and deep conversations. Felicia, talk about drink making. He he learned the drink making skill for you. At least you could recognize it. Be like, hey, Dominic, I heard you've been working on this. That is so cool. That is so nice. You think you can make me a drink sometime? Yeah, see? That's how you're supposed to talk to boys. I, I honestly feel so bad for Felicia. She wants to make out with Dominic, but she can't. And he's so sad because, you know, he's, like, catching feels for her. Dominic, where are you going? You're going to go work out? Fine, go work out. Jaden, what you doing, hun? You're still in your jammies. Um, outfit? Change outfits. Puts your everyday clothes on. Uh, Darian is going to pee his pants soon. I can help you with that, Darian. Oh, that is disgusting. Clean with vigor. And then use... He wanted to clean something earlier, so that's fine. He's fine with that. Uh, Felicia is going to read Love in the Time of Sandwiches. Honey, no. Ha, no. All right. Jaden, eh, I don't really know what you're doing. Watch a foosball game. He's apparently going to go play chess. And cloud gaze with Julio, apparently. Wait, who wanted to cloud gaze with Felicia? Jaden, can we actually ask you to come and do that? I think that's just friendly, isn't it? Friendly. Where is it? Guys, where is it? Why don't you just come over here and talk to her? Tell her an inside joke. And uh, brighten her day. And then we'll see if we can get them to cloud gaze. That shouldn't be that hard to do unless I just am blind and can't see it. Fire up, tell him to uh, talk about drink making. Dun dun dun. Compliment her outfit. Why can't I get them to cloud gaze? It's daytime. Friendly. 
I don't think I'm going to be able to have him do it. Uh, Felicia, can you ask him to cloud gaze? You can try for a baby, but you can't cloud gaze. Brighten day. You can try for a baby, but you can't cloud gaze. Okay. Um, da -dum -dum -dum. Express admiration. Give relationship advice. I don't think he wants to hear it from you, sweetheart. Yeah, I don't I don't think we're going to be able to cloud gaze. And it's almost 3 p.m., so really we can't. Mott's really... Oh, that's gonna... Oh, man. Darian. <laughs> yeah. All these sims are gonna break my heart. Dominic, honey, don't look. Don't look. Don't look. Why? Darian is the worst twin brother ever. At least Dominic didn't do this right in front of him. That was Jaden who did it in front of everyone else. He was the one who just came up and kissed her. <sighs> Dominic, please exercise. Do sit-ups. Come over here quickly before you see anything. Alright, I think we avoided it. Okay. Whew, Darian, you're such a brat. You're such a brat. He's like, I'm the good guy, but now I'm going to be a jerk about it. And then Dominic is supposed to be the bad boy, and he's the one getting his heart ripped off his sleeve here. These boys are going to drive me insane. Uh, you want to buy an instrument? No. Felicia, what are you doing now? Playing chess with Jaden. Yeah, she's like, enough of this this bothersome drama. And then Jaden's leaving. To do what is up with these boys? They're so energetic. And Dominic is coming over. Yeah, see, Jaden, you move your feet, you lose your seat. That's how competitive we are this late in the game. Unfortunately, I have to pause this here. Uh, Felicia... Honey, I need you to Are stop playing chess. Um, you're not going to make out with Dominic right now. We need to go. You can't ask him to be your boyfriend. Uh, don't talk to Jaden. I actually need you... I'm going to pause this because it's almost 3.30. Okay. Uh, da -da. Control, shift, C. Testing. Cheats on. Ooh, I got to spell it right. Cheats on. Okay. Felicia, my darling, can you please... Oh, wait, 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 wait. I was told that sims have to be standing up in order to teleport correctly. I read your guys' comments. I, I I, need your help a lot, so why don't you teleport yourself up here, Felicia. We'll go ahead and lock the door for everyone just to be safe. And uh, this is where we begin our... Uh, basically like our final rose ceremony almost at least the final one before the uh, rose uh, proposal I should say so I'm gonna go ahead and pause it real quick just so we can uh, take a sneak peek not we just so I can take a sneak peek at the relationships and see what Felicia is going to decide I honestly don't know how she's gonna decide you guys I th so much drama has happened in the last two parts how is she gonna base her decision is it going to be off of something that happened more recently in the last couple of parts or is it going to be something that was more from the start and kind of consistent throughout the entire challenge so far is she gonna i don't know i don't know but i'm gonna take a look and i will see you when we begin the rose ceremony all right, you guys i'm back with felicia on the balcony ready to begin the rose ceremony, the fifth rose ceremony. All right, we only started off with seven men. So after this, we're gonna have two left and only one rose ceremony after that. I'm so nervous, you guys, please. Oh my gosh, okay, I hope you just accept the way that Felicia had to make this decision because honestly, it's a toss up just based on their uh, relationships so far. But this is the final, basically the final rose ceremony that I have any kind of influence over in the next rose ceremony, there's only going to be two men. And that means you guys get to pick and you get to vote. And there should be a little poll down in the description bar down below where you can make your choice um, based on the final two, but I'm not going to have it available until the next part when we begin our um, overnight dates because I don't want to have any spoilers. 
But uh, let's see. Let's just get this started. Felicia's in an okay mood. She's in a decent mood. She's chatting with Darian right now. She just asked him how his day was going because this boy, honestly, look at how far he got his romantic relationship up. Their friendship bar is all the way up. This boy came out of nowhere in the last couple of parts and just completely stole our girl's heart. So why don't we go ahead and... What can we do? Offer him a rose because Darian had a lot of struggles at first dealing with the the nature of this whole experience, having all these other men that were cooning over uh, Felicia for her attention, for her love, and you know he came through that sadness, and he was still like, you know what? This girl means a lot to me, and I need to show her this, otherwise I'm gonna lose her forever. And he did, right in front of his brother. Boy's got, mm, I don't know, not going to say it. But anyways, uh, Darian is uh, for sure going to be staying to the final two. So I'm going to have you teleport back down here, baby. Um, Jaden or Dominic, who should we have come up next? Well, Jaden is working out and already changed out of his nice clothes. So we will have Dominic come on over here next. He's just playing on the computer. Looks like he's been waiting and ready to... Uh... Oh, I didn't make him get up and walk first. Don't do either of those. Please go here. It looks like he has been waiting patiently for his turn to talk to Felicia. So let's see if I can have you teleport here. Why do you want to chat with Julio so badly? Don't chat with Julio. Teleport here, please. Oh, there we go. There we go. Go here. All right, Felicia. Felicia, this is this is a big one. Let's first of all brighten his day. It's funny how she thinks of hot tub woohoo as soon as Dominic is here. She does really, really find him attractive, which is kind of hilarious. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to go ahead and queue up the uh, interaction that Felicia has chosen for Dominic. And while I'm at it, might as well make Jaden change, honestly. Outfits. Change outfit. Put your nice clothes back on and get off the treadmill. But anyways, give me a one moment and we will see what Felicia has decided. All right, you guys. Felicia has made up her mind. She knows what she's going to do. And I think Dominic is prepared and ready for, you know, whatever she has to kind of throw at him. So we'll see what she's decided. We'll see. I, I'm so nervous. Do you think she's going to, uh, you know, do something romantic? Or do you think she's going to ask him to be just friends? I don't know. I don't know. I do know. Would you like to know? All right, let's find out. I'm going to go ahead and play. He's like, oh, Felicia, you're so... Oh, my gosh! And she passionately kissed him. That means, obviously, that she wants him to stay, <laughs> and I couldn't get her to give him a rose. <laughs> and I don't want to, like, give them a ton of romantic relationship by trying to do this. And they're kissing. Okay. Dominic, thank you very much. You can come over here. Jaden, honey, can you please come up to the balcony? This is so heartbreaking, you guys. It was honestly such a difficult decision, and now you're kissing him. It was such a difficult decision, and I'm going to go ahead and tell you exactly how Felicia was able to make that decision. Don't brighten his day. Uh, do something, you know, tactful. Like, ask him about his day first. But it was honestly such a hard decision for Felicia to make. But ultimately, Darian was a sure choice, and Jaden and Dominic were such good contenders through the entire competition. And one of them had higher romance, one of them had higher friendship, and honestly, Felicia went with her gut. And who has she been thinking about every single day? Who does she constantly want to woohoo with? Who does she want to ask to be her boyfriend all the time? It's Dominic. And honestly, I think that she's kind of hesitant about Jaden because he did just have that huge massive divorce with his wife and he's got all the issues with his kids not that that matters because she met his kids and she enjoyed them but i don't think she is ready to kind of take on that much she's not ready for that much right now she doesn't want to be Jaden's rebound and although he's been so sweet to her he has been very forward especially in front of the other contestants and you know although they had a great friendship Jaden and Felicia are just not meant to be, they're not meant to be romantic with each other. So Felicia Hudson and Jaden Hathaway have decided to cool off their romantic relationship. So, um, 
Now Andy wants us to hang out. He's like, girl, I know you just dumped one of your men. Come on over. <laughs> no, Andy, stay out of this. That was, you were season one. But anyways, Jaden will be headed out in the next part. Well, before the next part, actually. And uh, it looks like we are left with our final two contestants, you guys. And what are the odds that they are twin brothers? Honestly, look at these are our men. We've got the the cool, collected handsome bad boy Dominic and then we've got the uh, the suave very sweet quiet kind Darian although they've kind of begun acting more and more like each other very similar I think they've both got their sweet times and they've both got their spicy times as I would call it and uh, Felicia's got a very tough decision up ahead of her and actually you guys have a really tough decision so in the next part we will go on our first solo date and uh, then in the next part we'll go on our second solo date so the next two parts will just be uh, overnight dates with each of the twins Darian and Dominic and then we will have our final rose ceremony and then we'll see how it goes from there I'm so nervous you guys so nervous but anyways thank you all so much for watching this was part number 16 of my sims 4 bachelorette challenge if you enjoyed it please go ahead and give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and be sure to leave your comments in the comment section down below because i absolutely love hearing from you guys but anyways thank you all for watching my name is terra nova and i hope you all have an absolutely fantastic day bye guys